जिंदगी की आवाजें सुनने का अधिकार हर व्यक्ति को मिलना चाहिए ब्रेटली करनाल मेडिकल सेंटर द्वारा करनाल के एक निजी होटल में यूनिवर्सल न्यू बॉर्न हियरिंग स्क्रीनिंग प्रोग्राम यू शुरू किया गया इस कंपनी के ब्रांड एम्बेसडर नामचीन ऑस्ट्रेलियन क्रिकेट खिलाड़ी ब्रेटली ने कार्यक्रम में शिरकत की सभी नवजात शिशुओं की सुनने की क्षमता की जांच जन्म के समय की ही की जानी जरूरी है यह सुनिश्चित करना इस प्रोग्राम का ही उद्देश्य है दुनिया भर में बहरेपन की समस्या से पीड़ित चार मिलियन लोगों में से 34 मिलियन बच्चे हैं। करनाल मेडिकल सेंटर के संचालक डॉक्टर संजय खन्ना ने बताया की जन्म के समय ही नवजात शिशु की सुनने की क्षमता की जाँच होना कितना महत्वपूर्ण है सुन पाने और खुशहाल जीवन जीने में लोगों की मदद करना यकीनन एक अमूल्य अनुभव है इस पहल में सहभागी होकर मुझे बहुत खुशी हो रही है इसमें सभी नवजात शिशुओं की जन्म के समय ही जांच की जाएगी हम ज्यादा से ज्यादा लोगों को यू के बारे में जागरूक करना चाहते हैं और मानते हैं कि बाल रोग विशेषज्ञ और अन्य सभी डॉक्टर्स जागरूकता को बढ़ाने में अहम भूमिका निभा सकते हैं हम सभी राज्य सरकारों से अनुरोध करते हैं की नवजात शिशुओं की सुनने की क्षमता की जाँच जन्म के समय ही करना अनिवार्य कर दिया जाए ताकि बहरेपन की समस्या के खिलाफ इस लड़ाई में हमें सहयोग मिलेगा और देश का भविष्य स्वस्थ खुशहाल रहे पहली बार तो मैं अब हैंडीकैप फील नहीं करता जनरल फील करता जनरल बच्चों के साथ कंपटीशन ही जनरल बच्चों के साथ आप देखो आपने कितनी दूर से बोला है एंड ही इज हियरिंग एंड आप देखो कितनी अच्छी स्पीच और हियरिंग डेवलप कर एक दो साल लगे मुझे बोलने में बाद में धीरे धीरे प्रैक्टिस करता हूँ जैसे आई एम कम्फर्टेबल आप सब बोल रहा हूँ चौदह साल चौदह साल हो गया मुझे Uh, as the global hearing ambassador for Cochlear, which I I love my role. I love what I get the opportunity to do. Firstly, to raise awareness uh, about hearing loss and about how we can assist young, certainly young children. Cochlear can fix all ages, but obviously we focus on the pediatrics, focusing on the children, because I believe that's the future. Uh, the reason why I got involved with Cochlear. A number of reasons. It's it's a wonderful Australian company with a great vision, and they're helping people across the world. And I guess secondly too, it's close to my heart because my son had a fall, he had an accident, and he damaged hearing in his right ear. So he had a fractured skull and subsequently lost his hearing in his right ear. Now, the good news for him that he actually did not need any intervention, did not need surgery. You don't need to go see you now a specialist to, to fix the problem. His problem fixed itself. It came back naturally because it was a compressed nerve. But as a worried parent, as I've seen a lot of parents have obviously had children with hearing impairment, I was worried about how my son was going to do at school, in life in general. But over a number of months, his hearing came back. It corrected itself. But every time I'd Google hearing loss in children. Cochlear kept coming up, and I Google again on the internet. Cochlear kept coming up, and I thought, "Who's this Cochlear? Why, why are they at the forefront of what's happening?" Long story short, I became involved with Cochlear after a meeting, and I want to put my heart and soul into this one of the falls. And I could have chose anything to do with blindness or cancer, which is all as important, but I've chosen the hearing loss because it's close to my heart. Well, we've been doing work out here collectively in India for the last six years. What I can say about hearing loss, it does not um, go through different. You know, it doesn't doesn't pick who it wants to pick on. In other words, it transcends all all cultures. So, doesn't matter what eye colour, hair colour, skin colour, hearing loss is hearing loss, and it's across the world. 
Now we know there's 460 million people across the world that suffer some form of hearing loss. We know that there's 34 million of those are children. The good news that Australia can, can lead from the front is that every single child that's born in Australia has the universal newborn hearing test done. In other words, they have they, they, they get screened when they're born. So if there's a problem, we can deal with the problem. In India, unfortunately, not every single child born has a hearing test. Down at Kerala, it's been outstanding. Kerala's been really, really good. And other, other parts of India have been outstanding too. There's some hospitals across India, we're, we've seen in Delhi, uh, that, that, that do 100% screening. So what my mission, what my aim is, that every single child born has that hearing test. If they have the hearing test, we know if there's a problem and we can deal with the problem.